Well, nights like these are just what you hope for as a spectator. A warm welcome. My name is Derek Ray, and my commentary partner, as usual, is Stuart Robson. I'm really thrilled to be bringing you live action from Ligue 2. Stuart, tell us about your pre-match thoughts. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out, who will affect the game, and who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. An awful lot of green space to run into. Well, not the easiest of saves, but you'd expect him to stop it. Can he deliver it with accuracy? And first-class defending, cleared off the line. Now they stopped them in their tracks. Brian Sumare. Nebihart with it. Might really be able to trouble them here. Superbly read and executed. Valentin Jacob. Soumare. Kuhn. Le Bihart with it. Well read to win possession back. Under a fair bit of pressure. They do pass the ball with authority. Could cross it in here. A chance now with the corner. Well, there's the confirmation. That was nowhere near to crossing the line, was it? And over it comes. Only well, failed to get it away properly. And beating the defender. Giving it a try. A goal! On the back of sustained pressure. Now they deservedly hold the advantage. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. But there's still plenty to do from here. He hits it so well, though. Lots of pace, lots of power, and the keeper just can't react in time. It's a great strike. So the ball rolling again with the scoreline standing at 1-0. Jacob. Well, great read there to intercept. Well, getting close to the half-time interval and the story so far, they're not really making home advantage count. Stuart, your take. Well, it's been a tight first half so far, but they haven't quite shown enough guile in the attacking third. If, however, they can be more dynamic in the 1v1 situations, they have the quality to turn this around. Jacob now a decent position has eyes for goal well the goalkeeper managed to make the save without much difficulty in the end well the electronic board showing one additional minute Didier and Dong that is that for the first half here
So back underway here into the second half. And an astute piece of defending. You certainly have got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point, Stuart. Well, Derek, he took his goal well and was a constant threat throughout that first half. I thought he showed a lot of skill to get out of tight situations and he had a real impact on the plate. Oh, that's a fine pass. Who can he pick out? Not all that convincing defensively. Well, threat about it. Well, the attacking options appear plentiful. Fine tackle there to prevent the chance. just lost his focus for a brief moment and now it'll be a corner and it is substitution time at this juncture not just from one side but from both so the corner played into the box not the result from the set piece they were looking for he takes aim can they slot it home? Well, able to survive that attacking push. Kuhn. Silva. Just 15 minutes remaining. Now, brilliant work to keep that one in play. DDA and Dong. Can they find a gap in the defence? Well, offside, I rather think he was caught in two minds. Well, he just needed to go elsewhere with his pass. He showed a complete lack of awareness there. A wonderful intervention. And we've entered the final five minutes. Usainu Tiun. They are making headway, but really they need a goal with time not on their side. Bodies forward and the break looks on. Well, possibilities in the centre. This could finish it. And in all likelihood, that is game over. So little time left for a response. Well, just look how he holds off the defender. He keeps his balance and he still hits the target. What a good goal that is. And there it is, the final whistle. Not what the home fans were hoping for before a ball was kicked today. Defeat for them. Well, Derek, I thought it was a subpar performance from them. Just didn't look as sharp as normal. And I don't think they deserved anything from the game. They need to get a better performance in next time out. Well, we're focusing on him for a reason. Played with real authority in attack, Stuart. Well, I thought he was excellent. Not only did he score a good goal, but his general play was outstanding. He certainly played a major part in their win here today.